What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. Let's dive into some watches. And we should dive into some divers' watches. And hey, I want to show you this. It's kind of an interesting packaging. Uh, it's called a tube. I feel like something should shoot out at me like a fake snake. But obviously, it says Dryden on there. And that's because what we have here are some Dryden. So it's kind of interesting that they came rolled up in this tube. I actually don't know if that's how it'll get delivered when you order it, these are on loan to me from the nice people at Dryden. And I just wanted to take a quick look at them. I already actually uh, poked around, but there's a lot of stuff that comes in here. And like I said, I'm not sure exactly what you'll get uh, when you order these things, but we have like some NATO straps and extra um, quick removal spring bars and things like that in here. But I know you didn't come to see like the extra watch straps. You want to see the watches themselves. And what I actually have here is something that's really cool. And maybe I'll start here. Uh, it's a Dryden Chrono Diver Series 1. And I have them in different color combos. And you know, I kind of took a peek. I didn't unwrap them per se. So what we have is a really nice looking uh, Chrono Diver. And it's 316L stainless steel, which you would expect. And 120 click unidirectional rotating bezel, really solid. I mean, there's no slop in there. You can hear it ratcheting. Can't get it moving the other way. Unidirectional. Hey, and then uh, you've got these dials here, which have kind of your sub dials in them. Let me swing in on this. Uh, this one is obviously black. It's black all the way around. I'm assuming it's like a PVD coating of some sort, but really nice. You have a little uh, um, design there on the sub dials, those concentric circles. We have a date window down at the four o'clock position, nice big luminous markers and uh, kind of arrow style hands there. I love the, it's kind of white and then these yellow uh, highlights around the hands. Nice and flat, 42 millimeter case, excluding the crown, 22 millimeter strap size, screw down crown, and it has a Seiko Mecha Quartz VK63 movement. So I obviously can see I can unscrew it there and demonstrate the mecha quartz, which means it's a quartz movement, drives this whole thing. But then you have mechanical components that attach to the quartz movement, kind of like mechanical watches, right? And so you get this nice solid click. You can see it ticking off the seconds here and then reset down here at the bottom, fly back like that. Now, the really nice thing about this and what Dryden has done here is sent me a few in the different color combos and I just want to run through them kind of in order of least to most desirable in my opinion. What you can see here is we have it in the blue. That is really beautiful. I really like this. I love black watches, but I have lots of black watches. So, you know, that's uh, pretty sinister and uh, subtle to me, but this is a really beautiful traditional. I love this. I, I don't know if I'd call it like an aquamarine, but that is just a really, really gorgeous watch. That is beautiful. But my favorite right here is this, uh, what they call, oh, let me make sure, sure I know what this is. Oh, the blue slash white. And this one is my ab fab of the, the three here, not just that. Beautiful eggshell white dial on there, silver hands, uh, kind of a mix of brush and silver case here. The shoulder is a little cheaper polished, like nice coin edge here. This is beautiful. I really love this style, but I will say that this watch too is a very close second for me. That is just a, that is a beautiful looking watch as well. And maybe the best thing about this is you get that reliable Seiko movement, uh, diver's watch with the chronograph and the Mecca Quartz. And if you go to the Dryden website, this watch is only $258 right now. So that is just really, really impressive. You can see screw on back here with the Dryden sailboat on it. Just, I think a, an incredible deal. And I love the fact that we, we have lots of color combos. It even looks like a blue panda dial. Look at that. Uh, even in some different angles here, the the bezel looks black. And so you, you kind of get that iridescence when you angle it towards the light. So really, really cool. Hey, I just wanted to do a quick show of this. And like I said, you can pick these up. I think it's at drydenwatches.com, um, but I'll put a link to them in the description. 
you want a really good looking watch at a really great price point. Peter Von Panda, out.